hello so today in this video I am going to show you how you can uh, use uh, the command like uh, generate and replace and how you can use if operator if you are having a survey data uh, in my previous video I have uh, shown you that how you can uh, declare a data to be survey data and uh, if you want to know more about this you can go through my previous video okay so now uh, how you can use let us suppose uh, that uh, uh, I am having uh, the data in which uh, I am having uh, I am having the external funds and internal fund the companies which are using external funds uh, for financing and the companies which are using internal funds for their financing now uh, I want to know uh, the, I want to make another variable in which uh, I want to know I, I want to see uh, that uh, what are those companies how many companies uh, what proportion of the companies are using both internal as well as external funds for their financing so for this I have to create one uh, another uh, variable uh, which I will create as uh, uh, I will create it by using generate generate uh, I will give it a name both fund both funds and this uh, both funds will be equal to this will be equal to 1 means it will be equal to 1 if my external funds external fund if external funds is equal to 1 and internal funds internal funds will be equal to 1 means that my external fund is having a value of 1 if the company has applied for external funds and the company is having a value 0 if it has not applied for external funds so if external funds value is equal to 1 and if internal funds means internal funds is also having a value of 1 in my variable if the company has applied if the company has used internal funds and if the company has not used internal funds for its financing then the value is 0 ok so uh, I can show you the I, uh, I'll show you my data also here you can see here uh, for external fund uh, external funding and this is for internal funding external funding is yes 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 and no and yes no okay and you can see here the values are here it is no and if it is no then it is zero and if it is yes then it is one in the same way here the values are zero and one okay if it is no then zero and yes then one okay so this is uh, the data and now those companies which have uh, both the funds for that uh, I have generated both funds named variable and uh, uh, if they have if, if it if uh, my fund value is having the value one it means that external fund is taken as well as and uh, internal funds are also taken but I have to give another value that is uh, my I will replace replace both funds is equal to zero if your external fund is equal to zero or if any of these two means either of external fund and internal fund if any of these two is zero means if any of these is not taken then it will not come in that in in our both funds named variable so if any of these two is having the value zero any of these two is having the value of zero in that case this value will be zero okay it means that the company has not taken both the fund they have uh, either taken external fund or they have taken in ex internal funds okay so if external funds is equal to is equal to zero 
or this this is the sign of or okay so or internal funds is equal to zero so any of these two is zero in that case my both funds will take the value zero okay so now i will show you browse or the three variables i will show you the external funds internal funds and new created both funds and now here you can see now this is uh, the both fund named variable which i have created and here you can see if external fund is taken internal funds is taken then yes it means both funds are taken okay here also but if external fund is not taken and internal fund is taken it means that both the funds are not taken so it has taken a value of zero in the same way both of them are not taken so it has taken a value zero if both are, take, are taken then value yes if any of these two is not taken in that case it has taken a value of zero okay it will take a value of one only if both the both the external funds and internal funds have the value one or they have both taken okay then only it will take a value of one okay so in this way you can create your variable now i want to know the proportion so if i want to know the proportion of uh, proportion of the internal funds uh, or proportion of the companies which have taken both the funds then i will take uh, i will use survey command uh, svy 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 and here i will take the variable growth cluster growth cluster is if growth cluster is equal to 1 i am taking the same example which i have taken in my previous video so if growth cluster is equal to 1 means uh, 1 is the value for those companies which are high growth companies okay so uh, growth cluster if it is one uh, means uh, my growth cluster is having two values uh, if i show you the variable also it is having two values one is the value that is one is high growth firm and second are the low growth firm okay and uh, here you can see that uh, high growth firm have the value 1 and non high growth firm have the value 2 so now if high growth firm is are, uh, if i am taking only high growth firm and i want to know uh, what are those uh, how many uh, what proportion of uh, high growth firms uh, have uh, both the applied for both the funds so if it is one in that case i will proportion both funds sorry here uh, i have uh, uh, done one mistake here i have to write sub also okay so survey survey sub if the growth cluster is one means i am having i am taking only high growth firm and i want to know the proportion of those firms which have uh, which are high growth and are uh, have uh, are using uh, both the funds so the proportion is this much means it means that those firms which have which have not used both the funds are 53 percent and those which have used both the funds are 46 percent those companies which are high growth as well as they have used both the funds these are 46 percent and which which do not have uh, used both the funds 
these are 53 percent in the same way if i want to know for low growth companies then in the same way i will again use svy sub my growth uh, variable that is growth cluster is equal to 2 now i am talking about non growth firms in case of non growth firms what proportion of firms have used both the funds so proportion of both fund proportion of both funds that is uh, again i have done one mistake here svy sub this time i have not used if if growth cluster is equal to 2 then what is the proportion of both funds so here 53 percent of the companies have not used in case of those which are low growth and 46 percent of the companies have used both the funds okay so this is what uh, we have i hope you like my video thanks for watching